Fear is something that um, is very real for most of us and that I struggle with from time to time. One of the promises that God's given me that's really helped me with fear is in Psalm 112, verse 7. It says, He is not afraid of bad news. His heart is firm, trusting in the Lord. I remember one of the things I was fearful about was selling the house that we had bought overseas when we were going to move back to the States. And I had kind of carried that fear over the entire time we lived in that house because I just wasn't sure how God was going to solve that problem when the time came. But when the time came for us to move back to the States, we showed the house and the first person that looked at it bought it. And God reminded me of this verse, not being afraid of the future, not to be afraid of bad news. And I, I, re I realized that I had worried about something for seven years, off and on, that I had no reason at all to worry about. I didn't know what God was going to do. There was anxiety over things that we, we did, couldn't foresee, that we didn't know. We're afraid of the future because we don't know what's going to happen. But when we look back, we can see God's faithfulness in so many situations. And so that, that just reminds me and teaches me that we don't know the future. We don't know what God's going to do. If he had not sold the house, he would have provided another solution to the problem. But why did I worry about it? And so it, that was, it was joyful for me because I, I realized that, please don't worry. I have the future in my hand and I'm going to take care of you. Whatever it is, if it's bad news, I'm going to be there with you in that bad news. If it's great news, I'm going to be there with you in that great news. But please don't worry. So whatever you're facing, <laughs> whatever worry you might have about the future, you don't need to worry. Whether it's good news or bad news, we don't know what God's going to do. We don't know how He's going to solve each issue, each problem but we know he's there. The Lord is gonna be with you. He has seen it all and he's gonna provide everything we need when it's hard and everything we need when it's great.